Hi everybody, this is Rebecca Lynn Barkley, aka Boobop197. This is my review for a day. And today's review, ladies and dudes, well my friends, it's that time again for another top 10 list that nobody has never done before. And this top 10 list, it's going to be the most wackiest list that you'll ever see in your life. So for my latest top 10 list is the top 10 most Oh, heck no moments for movies of all time. And to tell you the truth is, ladies and dudes, I have nothing to say about this list. All I can say about this list is there's going to be so many parts here and there for all the movies that we all know and love that evolves an oh, heck no moment that evolves when a main hero gets in trouble, or somebody's going to get all, on a wacky panic, or something that involves too much information. Oh, stay away from the too much information moment. Ah! That's all I can say about that part. So anyway, without further ado, ladies and dudes, here are my top ten most Oh, heck no moments of all time in movies! So let's get started. Number 10 goes to Taken, the first one. And it's a part where Brian Mills was trying to find a way to rescue his daughter Kim from those rather those evil sex trade business dudes. He grabbed one of them by hostage. And this is where the oh heck no moment came by. One of those evil dudes knocked Brian Mills unconscious and he got hanged by one of the pipes in handcuffs. And how will Brian Mills escape this mess in time and try to rescue his daughter Kim from being in the sex trade business world, if you know what I mean. Number nine goes to Aladdin. Oh yeah, Aladdin has one big oh heck no moment, all right. And it's the part where, you know, Aladdin and Jasmine had a really good time riding on a magic carpet ride. They shared their first kiss, and Aladdin's life is becoming kind of normal for him while he's disguising himself as a prince. But not until uh, those Sultan's guards had grabbed him and handcuffed him and put the thing in his mouth and Jafar told the guards to take Aladdin away from the palace and then yeah Aladdin went down to the ocean and gonna be drowned now that's what oh heck no no more I'll never forget Aladdin's gonna get drowned into the sea but not until the genie came by and saved his life. I put that in number nine. Number eight goes to the House of Flying Daggers. Oh yeah, there's an oh heck no more right here in this movie. And tell you the truth is, ladies and dudes, there's only four oh heck no moments in this movie. But I'm gonna pick one this time. And the biggest oh heck no moment I'll never forget in this movie is where two flying daggers had shown up in the air and one of them began to shoot on May's chest. And who the heck killed May? It's none other than Leo. How could Leo kill the one that he really loved for the last three years? Well, when you watch this movie, you'll know what I mean. Number seven goes to Batman Begins. I'm sorry, I brought, I got a bring the DVD back to the library, but anyway, oh yeah, this move, this movie does have an oh heck no moment, and that's the part where that Bruce Wayne's teacher had showed up to Bruce Wayne's party, and he told Bruce Wayne the truth that he is the real Ra's al Ghul, and I was like, no, no, that can't be true, no, not Liam Neeson's character, no! It kills me. And you know what Ra's al Ghul came here for? He wants to seek revenge on Bruce Wayne for what had happened to his house. And he wants to destroy Bruce Wayne's mansion and also Gotham City. That's 
that's what I call a big ol' heck no moment right there, ladies and dudes. Number six goes to the Nyan Museum 2, The Battle of Mitzodia. Oh yeah, I love this movie. It's pretty darn funny. I gotta go back and rewatch this film. It, it was really awesome. Oh yeah, there was a oh heck no moment in this movie. and It's the part where Larry and Amelia Earhart are heading on to the other museum that evolved plane, space, and whatever. And Larry Derry... Larry is trying to find those little Einsteins who could help them out to figure out the clue, the secret of the tomb, you know, the heart of the Pharaoh's tomb. And there was one big oh heck no moment that evolved where everybody's going to get ready to start all their blasting off thing, you know, spaceships and planes and whatever. And Larry Daly went on a wacky panic and he'll be too afraid to the museum is going to go in a big giant boom. That's one big oh heck no one. I'll never forget, but that was pretty funny. Number five goes to Titan AE. Oh yeah, there was an oh heck no moment in this film. And one of the best plot twists I ever seen in this movie is uh, where Cal and Kima found out that uh. Corso had betrayed the whole crew this whole entire time by working with the Dredge. And I was pretty shocked about it. This is one big oh heck no moment I'll never forget in this movie. Is where Kale's friend had betrayed the whole entire crew for all this time by working with the Dredge and trying to find that tight the Titan. You know, the main ship. I was so darn surprised. Okay, for number four goes to Star Trek IV, The Voyage Home. Now, here's a really good Oh Heck No Moment. That is truly one of the most best Oh Heck No Moments I'll, I'll never forget in movie history. But truly one of the funniest. It's the part where James D. Kirk and Spock are hanging on to the museum and try to check out these two humpback whales who are still alive in um, San Francisco. And there was one funny moment when they are in the museum. Uh, J.C. Kirk can't find his partner anywhere in the whole entire crowd. And he's going on a wacky panic where he saw Spock in the tank and he, he's swimming with the whales. It was so hilarious. But one of the biggest oh heck no moments I'll never forget in movie history. It was so darn hilarious. I'll never forget that one. Okay, ladies and dudes, here we go. The one we all been waiting for. My top three most biggest, oh heck no moments in movie history. And this one will be the most embarrassing ones of all. So let's get right to it. Number three goes to Liam Neeson's new film, and I'm sure it might be his worst one, Third Person. Oh yes, ladies and dudes, I'm talking about that oh heck no moment. It's a part in the hotel where Liam Neeson's character, Michael, heard a knock on the door, knock, knock on the door and he saw Anna wearing one of his robes. She took it by accident. I think she took a shower or something. And then Michael said, I guess he wants it back for some unknown reason. And then that's where the oh heck no moment came from. Ooh, that will be a worse nightmare. Oh no, not that oh heck no moment. Ah! Stay away from that scene, ladies and dudes. It's pretty darn scary, if you know what I mean. Number two goes to the Dark Crystal. Oh yeah, the Dark Crystal has one big oh heck no moment that nobody will never forget. It's during that scene where uh where the sec two Skaxies are facing each other for the trial by a stone and that general one and Jay Bullen got shocked about it, and this is where the oh heck no moment came by, is where all the Skeksis surrounded Chamberlain and they ripped off his clothes. Okay, that was way too much information, ladies and dudes. 
there is too many things that involves brief nudity in a puppet film. So yep, I decided to put that in number two. And finally, ladies and dudes, the number one most biggest oh heck no moment that we will never forget in movie history. I'd rather not call it a plot twist, but I'd rather call it the oh heck no moment. So here it is, ladies and dudes. The number one most biggest oh heck no moment that we will never forget in movie history goes to Star Wars Episode Five: The Empire Strikes. Back. Oh yes, ladies and dudes, this is the most biggest oh heck no moment in movie history. And this is the part where Luke Skywalker and Darth Vader had their fight and they... And this is the part where Darth Vader told Luke Skywalker the awful truth that he is truly his father. And Luke was like... No way. It can't be true. No. Oh, heck no. You're you're just my main enemy, for goodness sakes. There's no way you can't be my father. My father got killed in some lava accident or something. But nope, it's freaking true. Darth Vader is really Luke Skywalker's father. I'd rather call this an oh, heck no moment instead of a plot twist. Because you'll never know if... If something bad will happen, if, you know, to know about the shocking truth that you never know about for the rest of your life, I guess. So, anyway, Darth Vader telling Luke Skywalker the truth that he's really Luke Skywalker's dad deserves to be the number one most biggest oh heck no moment of all time, period. And there you go, ladies and dudes. Those are my top ten mo's. Oh, heck no moments of all time. I hope you enjoy this list and join me next time. Well, join me on Monday as I do my next top 10 list of the top 10 best oh heck yeah moments of all time in movies. So be prepared for that one to come and I'll see you all later. Sayonara. Oh, heck no. Please no more heck no moments in movie history. Ah!